Hello and welcome. We have in our hand Galaxy S8 from Canada, locked with the factory reset protection. We will show you how to remove it, so keep watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So, first of all, start by shutting down your phone. Then, put the phone on the download mode by holding volume down home button and power button all together until you see the screen then press the volume up to confirm entering the download mode as you can see here FRP lock is on now plug the USB cable and let's jump to the computer you need first to download the combination file in case you don't have it don't worry you will find the link below now launch Odin application and click on the AP button and browse the combination file that you just downloaded Just wait a moment until it's fully downloaded, then press the start button. After that the application will download the firmware on the phone. It will take some time, so we speed up the video. As you can see here, it's a custom firmware that will help us to remove the FRP lock. On the settings, you can take a look on the phone status. What concerns us is the developer options. From there, click the OEM unlocking and that's it now we have to download the original firmware and your phone is ready to use power off the phone then put it in the download mode using the same button combination as before After you downloaded the original firmware, fill the fields with the right file as we did, and then click the start button. In some cases, you will face this error. It's a kind of a security issue, so you have to download a custom version of Odin. And uh, as always, we make it easy for you. The link is in the description. Now, launch the custom Odin and uh, follow the steps that we did and finally click the start button. It will start by downloading the firmware to the phone. So be patient. Back to our phone, unplug the USB cable and just follow the, the usual suit of instructions. This time in the Wi-Fi screen, you can click on the next button without connecting to the internet. And that's it, your phone is back to work again. 
Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and see you again in the next tutorial.